Pick a seat. Pick a seat. Anyway, pick a baby. Giles <laughs> Pan, everybody. Diana Carolina. And Kelly Sheridan. Bill Newman. Thank everybody for watching the concert. I know, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Josh Hayward. Oh, 
<laughs> the theme song. <laughs> oh, I was going to say that. No. no. I like when Bill was singing in the elevator. Like, can you sing that one? Yeah, sure. Bill, remember you know the one? You were like, like full off your eye. Yeah. Did it. Yeah. You singing that? That's right. Oh, yeah. What was a priority? Yeah, it was kind of like that. It was perfect. Just like that. Yeah, it's hard to choose. Yeah. I like Pepsi, Pepsi, Pepsi. Yeah. Keep going. Keep going. I really love it. All right, we go to the next question. Yeah. All right. Don't be shocking. Yeah. Walking. I'm gonna show. Ready? Ready? Here's a big one. Ready? How did you get into voice acting slash writing? It was a okay. We're deaf over here. How did you get into voice acting? How did you get into voice acting? Yeah, I was uh, musical theater into improv into acting and into voice acting. Ooh. I was a super precocious kid who didn't know any better, and now it's the only thing I can do. So I'm useless if there's a song you can to And you called me here. The audiences of the world, everybody, every pony, every audience, you called me for it, and I agreed. Ta-da! Wow! Thank you very much. Yeah. I watched so many cartoons and I couldn't talk with a normal voice anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Is that everyone? Rapid fire. Right, yeah, rapid fire, baby. Rapid fire. Uh, what are your hobbies outside of work? Video games. <laughs> Looking for work. Winning. Do you know what you're winning? All right. So winning. 
Ready? Serious, you're ready. 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 The final one for me, and it's it's the biggest question of all. What does My Little Pony mean to you? A job. Hey. 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 Some of French magic at some point in their life. What's a piece of media 
sure that you all, that anyone thinks you can consume at least once in your life, be it book, movie, a TV show, even song. I'm pretty sure Hasbro would say that would be Dungeons and Dragons Honor Among Thieves, but do we really care for their opinion? Is there, there are actually several properties in our library that would fit that bill, so we'll have to get better. What do you You're really nailing like a soulless conglomerate. Well, I really pinchy and I love watching The Witcher. It's so exciting. I like the movie Bloodsport. Yeah, starring John Claude Van Damme. I don't think there's a Hasbro Gosh, all right, I would say Jumanji. <laughs> She's rooting for the board game. I'm rooting for the game. So I got a question for our young ladies. We understand that you're, you're kind of a moody person, but just speak from the heart. What do you actually think of the 1960s? Hmm. I mean, they're the worst. <laughs> Obviously. Thank yeah. You. Simple. They're the worst. They're yeah, the wise like the crazy. Crazy. Oh, All right, that's a question for all of you. Um, who do you think is the best Pegasus club? Best what? Pegasus. Uh, Pegasus. Oh, Pegasus. Pegasus. I mean, the winged dragon little guy sold really well for us. So I know it doesn't really answer your question. Um, okay, we think it's on increase, so we'll, we can expect to see more. Is Trixie a Pegasus? Yes. That's what I like. I mean, I'm going to have to steal that answer as well. Trixie's pretty great. Um, but so is Rainbow Dash. Fluttershy's pretty awesome. We could do a lot of Pegasi. Do 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 Griffin's now? Because they're also pretty great. And I'll just have all that. All that people that are cool winged folk. I like that rainbow hat. She's colorful. I'm on a frame. I mean, militarily speaking, I think we got my uh, my Brocco, so. Yeah, I'm a <laughs> Hasbro. <laughs> how, how much editing and restrictions do you give to the writers of the show? <laughs> yeah, Hasbro. Oh. Yeah, Hasbro. How, how many restrictions? Yeah, how many restrictions? <laughs> all, all of them. <laughs> uh, no, honestly, our, our writers have free reign to do whatever they want, and then they submit scripts for us to sign off on, which we do, and then the scripts. Air, finally, we berate them for it, you know, the things that they want to do. <laughs> and we would have seen had we read the scripts that they submitted. <laughs> Does that really happen? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Actually, I'm not in the news. So <laughs> cannot confirm nor deny. Uh, restrictions. This is for uh, Starlight. Would you rather? Fly kites with chrysalis, or repair wheels with Trixie and Y. Or or what wheels? What you say? Repair wheels with Trixie. <laughs> that is a tricky one, but uh, you know Trixie is my bestie, so I think um, despite some challenges in the past, I think the two of us could probably come up with. Just a really terrible casserole. <laughs> uh, and then we could just go out for dinner instead. So I'm going to pick uh, Trixie. Yeah. <laughs> Yay. Hello, question for Flashback. Hey. hey. What is it, what's it like being the last world of Pegasus Legion? <laughs> I would say that the birth is great, the honor is 
greater. And I, uh, I, I will continue as long as I can. Aria. Yes. Do you naturally like to sing or do you feel compelled to do it? Well, I'm compelled to start singing, but then once I'm singing, I like to do it. Uh, <laughs> has anybody ever confused you with Starlight? What was that? Has anybody ever confused you with Starlight? Has anyone confused me with Starlight because of our colors? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah it is kind of confusing. But, nah. Nah. I'm usually with my entourage and my sister tonight. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Hi, I'm Trey. What do you think of my own speak of Kelly Sarah? Is that a question for Yeah, for you. For me? So yeah. what was the question? What do you think of my own speak? What's my, what do I think of my OC? My OC. Or your OC. Yeah. Uh, it's awesome. Okay. <laughs> the best. Her thoughts are happy. I encourage um, yeah, yeah. all forms of creativity. Yeah. At school of Friendship, creativity is a great way to connect with other people, so I think your OC is awesome. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Awesome. <laughs> We'd rather it was copy. <laughs> <laughs> it's copy. That's fucked up. Hi. Hi. I have a question for Kelly and Diana. Do you guys ever have some common visual with Barbies? Because you guys are both Barbie characters and you're not the same color of the colonies, basically. <laughs> We can't enter this game. Well, also, Kelly, do you see a line in your evil um, Starlight voice? Can I do the evil Starlight voice? Yeah. Absolutely. Welcome to our little village. We're so happy you could join us. <laughs> Transition this into just using like the normal questions, and you can all be yourselves in it. How about we should we do the last three? Yeah, yeah you guys have questions for them or for their characters. What do you guys? I have questions for Josh. First of all, hi guys. Hi. hi. Everybody came here with their questions. So here's my question for you. All right, this is your first pony convention and everything like that. Probably your first real exposure to the panel. So what's your impression so far? What do you think? And I'm answering as flash bangers. You can be you. Oh, you can be oh my gosh. I'm oh. loving this. Honestly, from the moment from the moment I got introduced to Bandit in my first episode came out, it's my first introduction to Twitter. And I love it. And then now that I'm here in person, I am so excited to come I I I am loving every moment. He's been bouncing off the walls. I have been bouncing off the walls. I hit the bed this morning. You got a shield. So my first impression is I love it. But like I said, adventure. This was the big adventure for me, and everyone is so sweet and like just really, really interesting. And I'm, I've been every engagement I've had so far has been a delight. I, I, I I'm abusive about it. I could talk for a long time. It's perfect. It is everything. We have conversations. We all love it, even though we've done conventions before. It's the same thing. Absolutely. It doesn't go away. It, that's the feeling yeah. every single time. <laughs> awesome. And I love it. And I love. And I love seeing you. You know, you need to like see over and over again. Like, I just saw Bill three months ago, so, you know. Actually, well, the we're only here because of you, so thank you. Yeah, thank you so much. Hopefully I'm pronouncing your name correct. Diana? Yeah. Uh, question is for you. How did you come up with uh, Sapphire Marcello's voice, it seems like 
Why that accent? You know, when we went in to record that, I auditioned with three different accents. And when we came in, they weren't sure what they wanted, and we kind of made it up on the fly in the room and just kind of added this, added that. So I didn't come up with it before recording. I kind of melded in the three different accents I did in the audition. And were, did you have trouble laughing at Leech with her, her voice of Rand or how crazy it was? No, not at all, but we recorded at different times. Oh, no. I'm sad about that. But I do know we recorded together in different things, but that episode we didn't record together. I'm sure Puffy would be laughing. I would have been dying if, I was, if he was there. I Thank wish. You. This question is for Mrs. Clemmer. <laughs> Who would you prefer? Sunburst or Trixie? <gasps> oh, you can't pick between friends. What? They each have their own merits and each relationship is different. And so I do different things with, with each of them and different activities and there's like a different vibe. And I think relationships are like plants. <laughs> like the rhododendron, for example. <laughs> <laughs> and each of them have different needs, and they're their own unique thing, and they just grow on their own. And you can't really compare them to each other. It's like comparing apples to rope dads. Good answer. Hi, Tracy. Hello. Hello. This is, hi. This is a question kind of like overlapping what Inkify said. So, Kelly. Do you prefer singing your villain songs or like your good songs? Villain. Oh. <laughs> um. I don't know. I haven't sung many songs in the show, but I would say the villain songs are pretty, pretty fun. But uh, I said "Road to Friendship" is one of my favorite songs. At, one of my favorites. Hard to pick favorites. Just because being able to sing it with Kathleen in the studio and the back and forth is also super fun. You can argue that's also like maybe a tiny bit of a villain song. There's like a little bit of acrimony in that song, so it um, walks the line sometimes. Cool, thank you. Oh, thank you. Thanks, Hannah. Do we have any more people who want to ask questions? This one we get to flip. Come on, man. Homies, here we go, here we go. What's coming? What's coming? Yeah, yeah. I get the number one. Come on, gal, or would you be named to be close to my last question? Hi. 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 I am Onyx. I don't know if you guys are familiar with that. But today at three, me and my partner, Bongo B, are going to be hosting a poetry slam. Oh. Could you guys write a haiku about your poetry? Oh. Oh, my goodness. Mm. Hi. Just like a one-to-one. Do we have clearance from Hasbro? <laughs> <laughs> Do we have to sign an NDA? <laughs> 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 it's it just for fun. We wanted, oh, or you could vote for heroes or villains, and then I will count it when we do the game. Oh, I thought 
maybe flying kites is fine, but sometimes the wind blows at <laughs> broken strings. Each heartbreak. Oh. <laughs> it needs to work. It needs to work. It's out of and horns and arms. Let's just do high key. Let's get together and young. <laughs> now I'm rhyming, but I'm also doing that. It's all about you. Starlight. Favorite type of kite, go. My favorite type of kite. My favorite type of kite? Oh, you know, I'm a classist. Classic. Classic. Not a classic. Oh, We're done with that. So, which We're done with that part. This is so important. The classicist. Uh, everyone's equal. No, okay. Uh, <laughs> so, whenever you call the I know it's called, but for some reason I can't remember. <laughs> Just the triangle with the with the cross stick and the little cute tail with the bows on it, and, that, and that's it. The props are wonderful. Keep yeah. it simple. Let's keep it simple. Kiss. Yeah. yeah. It's the aristocracy here. Yeah. yeah. Triangles rule. Triangles rule. Hi again. Hi again. Yes. I, I have a question for Kelly and Ellen Bray. Um, um, for Kelly and Ellen Ray, are you, you, you going to play that cup game you play when you take PonyCon? Are we going to play the cup game? Like we'll throw the paper in the cup game with the tea? Oh, are we, we going to play the cup game? <laughs> are you talking about the tea bag slam? Yeah. Game? Okay, was that the craziest thing you've ever witnessed in your life? Yeah, I saw it on Okay. Um, Kelly and I, for those who don't understand ponies here, uh, we were at UK PonyCon and um, they made, what was the game called? The Taskmaster. It was like task, a, like a, a task, Taskmaster. Taskmaster, which is a show, very funny show in, in, in uh, Britain. And you had to do all these tasks. And one of the tasks that we had to do, and they were all fun and wild, you had to, there was a teacup about 12 feet away from us, or 15 feet, and you had to take tea bags, you had 20 tea bags, and you had to try and throw them and get them into a teacup. Really, and Kelly run. got up and she said, I'm not athletic, and I, I, you know, I'll try and cut it. She sort of like was like, oh, we'll see, I'm not good at this. And of course she goes, the first try, and she gets it in the teacup, right? <laughs> she won number one, right? And I went and cheated because I went into the audience and I made them hold the cup and then I threw it right in front of them. Like, doink, doink, doink. It's just part of Taskmaster. It's kind of getting around the rules. No, but that's like part of the game. 
you know, but it was really fun. And what, hey, let's talk to somebody about those games. We've got, I don't know, I, I'm up for throwing tea bags if we can get them. I don't know if I can do it again. Is, so that, like, is that like tea pong? It's like tea pong. Were, were the tea bags yeah. like wet or dry? No, dry. they were dry. So they're hard to throw. Yeah. It was they're hard. very light. But we could, we could do something yeah. like, you know, hey, ponies. Come up with a fun game like this, and I, I I can't talk for everybody here, but I bet. I don't you know if I can ever do that again. I wish she was the next spectacular. Night too, but it I, was like, as a nerdy, not sporty kid, it was like, oh, this is what it feels like to win an Olympic gold. Oh, I was, I was, I was, I was, I I was, 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 I and it was like she, you didn't believe her. It's like, oh, I've never bowled before, or I've never done darts before, and of course you get 10. It was too much. Like, really she was, she really, I talked about it, I literally, we talked about it earlier today. So, because I was like, remember when you got that tea bag in the cup? I was like, in shock. It, it changed my whole life. I went, you can do anything. <laughs> I feel like you can do it. When you think you can't do it, that is proof that you can do anything. It's amazing. That is what is called. Magic. Thanks for asking about that. Yeah. 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 yeah, set it up. Uh, uh, mm. I'm, more the <laughs> well, I'm excited well, to play this bag. It's very strange. Hi. 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 So my question is the reverse question. If there was a question you could ask the audience, what question would that be? But we're about to get there. That's an amazing segue. That's an amazing that's segue. Right. You're so smart. It's like yes. you're a psychic. You are psychic. Are you a psychic? <laughs> no. Are you magic? No. Oh. <laughs> yes, you are. Well, okay. okay maybe. The, two, the, the two behind you, did you have questions? So after you two, well, maybe we'll move over to the other thing. Yeah, we're not just looking at your question. No, no, no. This is like, no, this you. is what's up next. Posting and practice. <laughs> Hello. Hi. 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 Uh, I've got a question for Black Magnus. Hi. So uh, I don't think you got your own episode, like seeing how you melded into the new Pony World. Uh, it showed a little bit of it, but what do you think an episode would look like, like that for the winner? I think a chunk of the episode would be me crying when I was a kid. Because I feel like Flash Magnus off duty. I think that it would be me going around and trying to hide. Hide. And just meeting all meeting everybody case. and, 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 and playing the new game and everything else. I know on duty of a very serious calling when I'm off, I think there is a point of truth. So that my my path it, is it would basically be me going around and trying not to play all the games. Hardy Hardy and Fruity one. Hardy Hardy and Fruity one. I wanna see that. I wanna see Flash Magnus with his game. Cuffs in your eyes. My baby. For Josh, Kate, Josh, uh, playing as Hasbro, may we have some Killers and Siren Sisters originally licensed products, please? Wait, oh, do I love you? Hold on a second. Do I love you? <laughs> he's just he's just checking with corporate. <laughs> yeah, to, there's a couple of different that. layers of people I have to ask. Yeah, yeah, some shareholders. Yeah, hold on. You're awesome. <laughs> I see. You're the best. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Thank you. Love you. Thank you. All right. Are you ready for the final part of this lovely, lovely evening? Yeah. 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 So now we're going to do a reverse Q and A. Where you can come up to the mic, and they're going to ask you a question. <laughs> and we're just gonna go whoever goes first. Yeah. First come first serve. I believe you. Hi. Hello. What's your name? My name is Gage. Hi. How are you doing, Gage? I'm doing great. Okay. Uh, I would like to know which. Se Do you have a favorite season of the show? Um, well. Not really sure. I mostly started for halfway through. I actually my first, my first full season I watched was season four. Woo! Perfect. Season four. 
all the way through time. Yeah, you can say that, I guess. Awesome. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. I went, because like when it comes to the Simpsons, people sort of talk about, you know, like this chunk of seasons is the best and that's their favorite and they move on. Yeah, so I always kind of wonder, like, where is the sweet spot where everybody's like, oh, Pinnacle is this one, and then, like, you know, maybe, I don't know if there was a shark jump, but, like, was there, or were the early ones their favorite? Or, no, I don't know. Do you have to ask him? Oh, yes. 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 Oh, is it? Oh, I do. Hi, what's your name? I'm Coach of Burning. Oh, great. And so how many conventions have you been to in your career? <laughs> oh, you go. Just my little party conventions is probably. Oh, yeah, so you're awesome. Probably 24. Oh, nice. Okay, so this is a two parter. Do you like pizza with pineapple? <laughs> or without? This is a It's a two parter. Do you like pizza <laughs> with pineapple? Or without? I, think have to, I think we have to get the answer to the first part first before we can decide if he's okay. <laughs> so, yeah, yeah. I'm okay. Okay. I'm, I'm okay with pineapple pizza. Okay, now, which pony, this is important, which pony in the canon, 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 I'm going to say it five times, there's magic happening, thank you, okay. thank you, Tricky. which pony puts pineapple on every time? Think about it, Gen 5, maybe, I, that was a hint, goodbye. <laughs> Grandma Piggy. Oh, what? I didn't hear what you said. <laughs> yes. Oh my God, how did you know that? That's okay, a real person. Okay, well, there is something. You know, the pizza, so they talk about pizza, right? But Grandma Piggy does love pineapple on her pizza. Okay, so big points on. there. Ding, 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 ding. I'm going to be spending the rest of the day thinking about like, which of the ponies would eat the pineapple pizza. Do you think you would put it in there? Yeah, yeah, like that, but it would be incidental, I feel like. Right? Like, that would just be like, out. Yeah, she's like, you like to cook with a sweet thing. No, I want pizza. <laughs> I want pizza too. Hi. Hi. My question for you is. I'm trying to think of questions we get asked often that I can reverse. What got you into audience singing? <laughs> I have to say, when I was in elementary school, I was required to be in an audience, and I discovered within myself a need to get yeah, to the audience training, right? due to the threat of being put into tension if I did not audience. Uh, and yeah. that fear has evolved into a love. It's kind of a Stockholm Syndrome situation. Yeah. <laughs> it's just now I can talk to people like you who I actually want to see on stage. So yeah. that's, that's a good yeah.
crosses with the furry fan, and there's a lot of back and forth, so probably not. In there? I, I, I can see them those. probably getting along with each other. Nice. Are we talking about like crossover situation? I'm talking about crossover situation. Like, if they showed up in other... an episode of something else. You know what? I actually like NCIS, so I'm Oh, NCIS is right off, yeah. I'm going to I'm going to I'm like Denozo. People have to whack me on the back of the head to get me to shut up, so. Nice one. Awesome. Awesome. I would like a fully law and order. for those that aren't unicorns. Uh, how would you decorate your unicorn one? Ooh. If you had all the crafts available to you, and you could put any colors and any stuff on your unicorn one, how would you display it? It's kind of like um, Ponytown, where you can kind of put stripes off on your ponies, or you can you know, put all kinds of cool things. What would, how would you decorate your unicorn one? Because Izzy is my age, but she's my pony. Um, so, decoration is more uh, uh, maybe like red, white stripes, and uh, uh, maybe some uh, I shade around it just for, just for style, variety, and that's all I can think of it. If I lent you some glitter, would you? Oh, Ellie sure. I bought some that I can't use. Right? So just hit me up later, right? You know you for our crafting sessions. I was hitting glitter, sure. The more the merrier. Yes, awesome. The more the merrier. Awesome, awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, I got one. Oh, oh no, no, no. Are you going to look at Josh? No, Josh, no. What's your name again? Okay, real quick, before we ask you a question, Diana, can you give the answer to Good answer to yours? Sure. Magic ponies like Star Trek Go Events. Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah. So I think Pony yeah. Or hold the back. Yeah. Or All of it. All of it. Josh. Uh, pony powers, which do you choose? Light, magic, or speed strong? Or album, if you want to hold it. 
Uh, I guess it would have to be uh, one of my favorite soundtracks ever. That would have to be the original Star Wars. Nice. Mm -hmm. Nice. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Like you hope episode seven. Uh, yes. Yeah, awesome. Thank you. Nice. Yeah. Good call. Yeah, you've got exactly. You've already got music in there, right? You've got the whole jump Yeah. Oh. Uh, yeah. I am blocking out the sun. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, I've got one. Do you need another one? No. I've got one. Okay. Can you do the voice of your favorite character? <laughs> do it for us. Uh, or, or your least favorite character. <laughs> you might have to lay down. Yeah, I, I, I realize it's a little Not so easy, is it? <laughs> <laughs> the tables have turned. Uh, <laughs> my problem is that my favorite character is a girl, and I have a very nice voice. You can do it, I can. You can do Come it. Come on, go for it. You can do anything. She can have some balls. Here we go. Be very careful about Felix. She's very sensitive. <laughs> yes. Yes. Oh. Like, look at the mirror. Awesome. That was fantastic. Love it. Thank you. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. 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 I just need to go. Oh, oh, oh. 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 I apologize to everybody way back there, but we only have about five minutes left, so. Yes. Just about seven. Okay. Okay. Uh, people like the reverse I have, Q &A. I have a question. Yes. If you were faculty at the School of Friendship, what would you teach? Oh, that's a good one. Mm. Good question. Mm. Excellent question. Thank you. Mm. What I teach? Yeah. I have no idea. <laughs> History. I. I would just say music because I love singing and I'm a high tenor. Perfect. Sing some. Sing some. Yeah. Should I, guys? Yeah. Should I? I could. A true, true friend helps a friend in need. A friend to be there to help them see. A true, true friend helps a friend can be the single light that shines from a true, true friend. Yeah, come on, get on a sticker. Let's all get a sticker right now. Woo, 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 woo. Come on, that was, that was something. All right, here. Um, next. Next. No, 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 Oh, I'm very good at the job. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Thank you. I think I'd be really greedy. I'll make you lots of cheddar. <laughs> I'm not close and tall. Oh. 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 Way to break it down. <laughs> it's anti <-dewing. laughs> Any more questions? And how about you? Uh, no, go, go, go. Okay, okay. John. If you could bring any pony into the real world, who would you choose and what would you do with them first? Oh, uh, uh, no, wait. What? Wait. Let's put well. some conditions on this. <laughs> <laughs>
Okay, I've got a question. Okay. I got one. What, like, this world invention would you want to implement into the Pony Express? Oh. Oh, man. This world's so nasty. Yeah. That they don't have already, of course. I mean, no more phones in G5 exist. G4, they don't, so. So you can text. Okay, your favorite cutie Mark Crusader. Who is it? Yes, and can you do her voice?